welcome to the second chapter of the module 2 environment setup that is software requirements what softwares we would be needing to learn this course first thing you need to install the node.js once you install the node.js whatever the latest version is lts is that you need to install on your machine also you need to install mongodb you need to install what mongodb now see the installation process for these softwares are different on the different platforms for example if you are using windows installation steps are different if you are using mac installation steps are different that's why i'm not covering in depth installation steps over here but these are pretty easy if you go to the official website for all these things you will find a proper documentation over there well if you get any queries write below in the comment box i will help you out there as well okay so you need a node.js you need mongo you need mysql then coding editor a lot of coding editors i have mentioned over, over here but out of this we would be using visual studio vs code only throughout the session throughout the session we would be using the vs code only well then you need to have a browser one browser need to be installed on your machine i will highly recommend the brave browser or the chrome brave or the chrome one of that you can install on your machine right so brave is nothing but the google chrome that's why i didn't write it separately over here but you can install it then git in the next session in the one of the one of the session we are going to see in details about the git but as a part of the software requirement i have mentioned it here as well so you need to install the git also so there is something called as git scm so this book whatever book the link already shared in the description you can go to the description and check this this page over there you will find git scm so you require this git client so you can install it follow the steps on the official doc and the client would be getting installed on your machine well the package manager so whenever you install the node.js npm comes by default npm come by default if you want to install something like this yarn you can install it yarn but i will not suggest you to install yarn at this point in time so in the future whenever we will start with the node.js at that time i will install the yarn and you can follow the steps after me but presently just install the node.js npm would be there so what is package what is package manager what is git right what is mysql what is mongo what is node and npm don't worry right now we have a separate dedicated session on it then these things are not required immediately devops related softwares like we don't need you don't need to install the docker right now kubernetes or the jenkins we can install it separately in the future but i have written it because you need to install in the future and that's why that's why i have mentioned it over here well these are the software requirements for this course right if you have these things you can learn this course very easily that's it thank you